everyone, this is Paul with PicoPros.com and today we're going to take a nice look at the AXA P2 Junior. This is the latest battery powered Pico from AXA Technologies. This one retails for just $199 US dollars on their website, axatech.com. And this guy is pretty interesting because it is a 720p projector putting out 55 lumens when it's plugged into the wall charger. And so it's really an interesting buy at only $199. So this guy has connectivity to HDMI, composite, video, VGA, that kind of thing. Uh, SD micro, micro SD card slot, uh, USB thumb drive connectivity, all kinds of things. So it's a really interesting projector for, again, just $199. So we're going to give you a short view of this with some video that I have set up, an HD video. And uh, so that's the projector right there hooked up to the HDMI port and I have that hooked up to my laptop. So if I zoom out here, I can show you our setup here. All right, so here we go. I have a projecting on a small thin line screen and we're projecting about a 30 inch image. So nothing, you know, that big, but for 55 lumens, that's generally where you want to be is in the three to five feet range. So we're showing you in a well lit room here it produces a nice bright image and uh, we're actually going to go ahead and show you some video so what I'm going to do is dim the lights and then we'll pair it to the HDMI connection and fire up some video alright so you can see in a darkened environment this is really nice really bright image in a darkened room and you can see the menu here for the AXA P2 Junior so you have the capability to hook up to a VGA port for your laptop, uh, composite video on a digital cam camera or something, HDMI port on a laptop or Blu-ray player, the embedded micro SD memory card slot, uh, the USB thumb drive so you can stream content from a thumb drive, and then the settings menu. And the settings basically we're going to use factory settings as we always do with our videos, but you do have the opportunity to tweak the settings if need be. So what we're going to do here is actually connect to the HDMI port simply by navigating the buttons on the top of the unit. And so there's the uh, HDMI port and I'm just going to select OK. And it's going to mirror what's on my laptop. Alright, so right away you can see I pulled up a YouTube video and this is what we're mirroring right here. And I'm just going to fire it up. I'm going to set it to a higher resolution. So you can see it produces a really vibrant image. Nice contrast. You can see the dark planes. And that's the embedded speaker on the PK, uh, excuse me, the P2 Junior. So it's not a bad speaker as far as Pico projectors go. And the fan, the fan is on, believe it or not, and you can pretty much not hear it at all. This is actually one of the better jobs as far as a fan for a Pico projector. So whatever fan they're using, whatever configuration, whoever designed that did an excellent job. Most Pico projectors, the fan whirl is very annoying. This one. You can't even hear it unless your ear is right up to it. So I have the speaker all the way up, and it, it's, it's decent. I mean, it's flat as all Pico projectors are as far as sound goes. But again, the fan noise is virtually non-existent. So let me turn down the sound a little. And so that's as simple as just hitting the down arrow when you're projecting the video. But... Uh, you can see the whites are crisp, the blues are deep, really nice colors. Really good contrast with the dark areas and the shadows of the planes. So this is a really good video for showing off. Uh, pretty good contrast. I believe it's a 1,000 to 1 contrast ratio for this. Again, the, the PK, uh, excuse me, the P2 Junior is a DLP based unit. So you're going to get that really good image quality. Uh, with this unit. And again, for only $199, the P2 Junior is something that 
is affordable to basically everyone. So there's really no excuse not to have a Pico projector at this point, given the specs on this one, as well as the performance. Let me zoom in a little here. So you can see, obviously, the images are fantastic. So again, I'm using the HDMI port, so we're getting the full 720p capability out of the unit. And so obviously, not just YouTube videos, but you can stream your cable box, you can do presentations, and again, this is a battery-powered unit as well. And what I'll show you real quick is when I unplug the wall charger, it gets a little bit dimmer, but it's still very nice and bright. Let me do that right now. Okay. So you can see that it's still pretty darn bright. Zoom out here. So we're going to leave it there. This is the uh, AXA P2 Junior retailing for just $199. Visit AXA's website for more details. That's axatech.com. Visit picopros.com for all the details on this and other projectors. Follow us on Facebook at facebook.com slash picopros, youtube.com slash picopros, and twitter.com slash picopros. We're all over the place. So be sure to stay in contact with us. We love talking Pico projectors. Again, this is the Axa P2 Junior, and this is PaulsPicoPros.com, and we'll talk to you soon. Thanks.